Uh, this is the IBM 5140 convertible. It came out in 1986. Uh, it uh, has three programs with it uh, that I have here. Uh, one is the startup disk, uh, just uh, DOS. The other one is programs and information. Uh, and the other one is a combination of both the DOS and the applications that you can use. So we'll go ahead and do a boot up on this. It has a backlit screen which it makes it easier to see than the original one that it came out with. Which I have on another machine. It counts the memory. It's showing 640 KB of memory. This is just asking for time and date. It's two seven hundred and twenty kilobyte floppy drives. Both are in working condition. This is A and that is B. It's asking for a new date which you can put in. Asking for a time. And as long as the machine is powered up it will keep those dates in time. As you can see it's uh, DOS version 3.3. And if you want to know what's on it, you just push directory and enter. And that will show you what's on it. If you actually really want to read everything, you can either print it off or with an adapter uh, that you can get online. So if you want to just see it on the screen, you type that directory slash p and it will pause it on the screen so you can see what's in the DOS program. And the key that continues. Again. And that's what's on that disk. Now uh, I'm going to put this other disk in the DOS program and information and reboot. And it always gives you a count on the memory to show you that it's working. Now when this screen's up, comes up, it shows you that it has some information for you that you can go in and uh, look at. It helps you understand how to operate the uh, 5140. Um, some good hints in there. Uh, diagnostics you can run. Uh, and how to set up the software if you want to make a new disk with programs. And now I'll just go ahead and reboot again and put this disk in and show you how it boots up with that one with the programs and everything. Remember it's this one with the DOS programs and information that has this screen on it to help you or walk you through how to use this machine. So we'll restart again.
Now this screen is the programs that came with the 5140. Uh, as you can see it has a whole bunch of stuff uh, in it. Um, if we, uh, it's all done by the F buttons, F1 through 10. Uh, if we go to F2, which is uh, tools, it will display what tools are available to you. And this will uh, be something that you're going to have to learn how to use, but it's all in there as part of the programming. So you don't have to load a bunch of programs. Uh, the, you can, in fact, load other programs in. If you press this button, sorry, it's not that button. Oh, I'm sorry, got to escape out. <laughs> Back to that. If you go to oh, having troubles. <laughs> seeing the screen in the bright light. Um, at any rate, uh, you can add programs in. Uh, there's another screen that lets you load stuff in. You'll have to learn how to do that. Um, but this shows you that it's a fully functional system. Uh, and we'll take this back out and reboot. In this I just wanted to show you that the other drive does work if you go with a B colon it'll switch over to the other drive right there and then you type in directory lights up it's reading the disk it tells you what all is on the disk So that's it. Everything works. Thank you.